All right, for the next exercise, we have a kettlebell goblet squat. You can use a dumbbell, you can use a plate, you can hug a, a medicine ball or a slam ball, whatever the weight might be, it's fun. Okay, so basically, you've, if you got to this point, you have now figured out your squat stance, you know how to squat properly. Um, so I'm just gonna go really quickly through the checklist, creating a tension by corkscrewing your feet into the ground, so tension in your hips, belt buckle to chin, rib cage pulled down, double chin, and when I take a big breath, I'm gonna fill my belly and my back, okay? So I'm just gonna grab my kettlebell here, bring it up into the rack position, elbows are in tight, okay? <clears throat> I'm going to go through my checklist that I just mentioned. Big breath. I'm going to hinge up my hips slightly for the first five degrees just to load my butt and my hamstrings and then pull myself down into the goblet squat and then exhale up. Okay. So big breath. Hinge down. Just to give you more of a side. Big breath. And that's your kettlebell goblet squat.